really trying to hold it together, but she's not. She told me not to go. She did? I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. You're so used to being strong for everyone else, but sometimes you forget that you have to be strong for yourself. I know. I can't help it. I wish someone would just tell me what the right thing is. Jane, there's no right thing. Everyone is always telling you to do this and to do that, but just because they're saying it's right doesn't mean it actually is, you know? The only right thing in this situation is what you decide you can live with, whatever that is. It's just like you told me. And you know, I finally told my parents I don't want to be a lawyer. And it sucked a lot for a minute, but they get it. They aren't happy about it, but they get it. Cabs, I am so proud of you. And no matter what you decide, you'll always be my best friend, roommates or not. And I will understand if you think you need to stay, but I will also understand if you decide you need to leave. And so will everyone else in their own time. Maybe not right away, and it will probably be hell in the meantime, but eventually you'll get it. I'm just going to have to think. Okay, do whatever you got to do. But no matter what you decide, you won't be alone. Thanks, Gabs. I wish. I wish there was a right answer. She raised me. She was my best friend. We were normal. <laughs> well, at least. Our own kind of way. She was my hero, my everything. I can't even remember how it all started to change. It seems like overnight the nightmare took. Now she's like a person I don't know. I can't save her. I can't make her wish come true. She wants to hold on to me. But tell me what good would that do?
leaving her application essay on her bedside table. Jane exits through her bedroom window. Lila enters Jane's bedroom, finding the essay and a single dandelion. 